you, Stephanie. Who else here loves data? All right, all right. Me too. I've worked with data for over a decade and know firsthand just how hard it is to turn that raw data into something useful. Today, I'll show how our new data science agent helps us turn that raw data into a data app. This app will help sales managers access personalized forecasts at our construction company. I'll start in a BigQuery notebook that's powered by Colab to build our forecast. To do so, I'm going to check out my product sales table with a little bit of SQL code that I pasted in from the clipboard. We can see the table here. And if you'll notice, there's a DF beside the input. DF stands for data frame. And that's BigQuery loading its results into a Python data frame. Python allows us to use libraries like BigFrames to execute my code over tables of any size. So I'll use it to paste in a little bit more Python to drop a few columns we don't need for our analysis. And I'll write one more cell to aggregate total sales by fields like order date and customer state. And this just helps give us some metrics for the rest of our forecast. This tabular view here is great, but seeing the data is even better. So when I switch over to the chart view, I can start to spot interesting patterns or potential issues before going deeper. Next, I'll use this data to forecast sales with the Gemini data science agent that's built into this notebook. All I need to do is click Ask Agent, and I'll input a prompt to generate a sales forecast from our input table. From here on out, all code is generated and executed by the Gemini data science agent. This is a collaborative process, so the data science agent acts kind of like my peer. We can go back and forth in simple natural language in this chat box, and you'll also notice that the agent uses Spark for feature engineering. This is only possible because of our new serverless Spark engine in BigQuery. So switching between SQL, Spark, and Python is now easy and allows developers like you and me to use the right tool for the job. That's something I think we could all get used to. So here the Spark code reads from our input table, applies some light transformations, and writes to a transform table. Next, to build the forecast, our agent uses a new Google foundation model called TimesFM. It's meant for forecasting, and it's accessible directly in BigQuery. Unlike traditional models, this one's pre-trained on massive time series data sets, so I can get forecasts simply by inputting my data. Let's take a quick look at the output. I'll exit out of the data science agent, and we can see for every product ID and date combination, we now have a forecasted value, as well as lower and upper bounds for a 95% confidence interval. But our chart view helps us see this even better. And this is the kind of thing I want to share with my sales managers. But for that, I'm going to need a data app so that all of my assets are packaged up and easily shareable. But here's a secret. I don't really like building apps. So watch this. Right within this notebook, I can click Create Data App, select the cells I'm interested in publishing. In this case, it'll just be the visualization. I can click Next, and I'll leave the default inputs here. When I click Create, BigQuery packages everything up and gives me a link that's external. That means this forecast is now a data app that's accessible to everyone. So sales managers can now directly access this app. They can input their own parameters and get personalized forecasts without needing to know any data science at all. Now that's powerful. So, I'm psyched about this too. So we easily transformed raw data into a fully deployed forecasting data app made possible by this data science agent. But wait, there's more. We're also launching specialized agents for data engineers, data analysts, and business users in preview. And the data science agent you just saw integrated in BigQuery notebooks is coming soon. You can also get started in Colab today. 
So scan the QR code on the screen and start building. I can't wait to see what you create. Thank you.